Chicago, Illinois. Well, Oswego, Illinois, but from a suburb of Chicago. Yes, I have an older sister and an older brother. They both played sports growing up. My sister is a dancer, and my brother ran um, cross country and played basketball. And stuff. Um, when I was five, my parents just signed me up for like a little rec league, and I ended up just loving it and continued to play every year. I basically played every other sport. Did basketball, volleyball, track, softball, gymnastics. So I played them all. I really liked gymnastics, and I liked basketball as well, and volleyball. <laughs> But soccer, for some reason, just kind of stuck with me, and that's just what I decided to concentrate on once I got into high school. Um, I was, I liked doing homework and doing projects, and um, I mean, my work ethic, I think, in the classroom was the same that is it is on the field. Um, you know, good student, I guess I could say. Um, I actually knew Cell because Cell and I played in the States uh, for a summer and I just really wanted the opportunity to play overseas again. I played in Sweden and I really enjoyed it and this opportunity came up for me to come here and so I figured it would be a great time for the off season, just kind of get out and travel a little bit more and have a different experience. Yes I am. It's a lot of fun. It's a bit different but it's good. It's fun. Um, sometimes I miss my family and I miss my little nieces and nephews a lot, so it'll be good to get back home and be closer to them, be with them. Just hanging out, going down to the city, exploring different things. We're going to go to Sydney next week, so we'll get to see that and trying to plan a trip in uh, Gold Coast and things like that. So. Yeah. It's just different. Um, for me, like right now, like playing professional in the States, that's like our job, that's all we do. So it's a bit different to come here to know that other people, you know, come from work every single day or have different duties and things like that than just playing soccer. Yes, it's very awesome. It's, the league just started again this year. It was around a couple of years, about three years, and then it folded and they just brought it back last year. So last year was the first year they had it back. It's definitely a dream come true to just be able to play soccer every day is your job. So It's definitely getting better, but it's not as big as baseball or basketball or football. Those definitely overtake, but um, women's soccer is getting there. Men's soccer still is, you know, making their way and things like that, but women's soccer is getting better. Um, a little bit, but I sometimes I don't think of that. I some, often forget that I'm 26 years old, and I like to think that I'm still a teenager, like right out of college, and don't really think I'm 26. So, um, coming here and realizing that I'm one of the older players, I think, is just a really good learning experience for me because I do have to step up my leadership in different ways versus than I do back home. Um, so I think for me, it's just really good, and it's only going to help my game. Um, I think we'll be pretty good. I think we can be a top team and definitely make our way into the finals. Uh, we just got to stay on top of it and, you know, bring every, bring all our competitive aspects every single game and just be positive and go out there and work hard. Good things will come. I think I'm pretty competitive. I hate to lose and I, I just like to go out and battle. And I think I pretty much leave it all out on the field every single time. That I play. No, just because it's something like you've been battling with your whole life, but obviously, um, you do like you would like to have people realize and see that we work just as hard as the guys, and that we go in there and we put in just as much effort and time and things like that to make ourselves better and to make our teams better. Um, we do the same things the guys do, and so it would be great to just have like that recognition and to have people respect that and know that we do 
you know, just amount of the same work as the guys do. Um, not so much here, like right away. I think maybe within a couple of years and like the league just continues to grow, but I don't think it's going to happen like within like a year or two. But it would just keep growing. Uh, just going to go back home and take some time off and enjoy the holidays with my family and my friends and then uh, start training again for preseason. It starts in March. Just to continue to be like better every single day I go out there. Like last year was like an awesome season for me. I learned so much and just became a whole different player. So this year I just hope to take the things that I learned from last year and to bring them into my game this year and just be consistent and solid for the season and be um, an impact player for Chicago this year. I'm hopefully still playing soccer. <laughs> I don't really want to ever stop playing soccer, and if I don't have the opportunity to play soccer, um, I want to become an, a triathlete. That's what I would like to do. <laughs>